are back. He is one of the original Triple Threats, Grammy, Tony, uh, uh, an Emmy Award winning artist. Of course, we're talking about Barry Manilow. He's got a new released album, newly released album, a tribute to a memorable decade. Memorable for me, Barry, I can tell you. That is the 80s, and it's the greatest songs of the 80s. Mary, good morning to you. Good morning. It's, uh, I, I think you can do it. I think I'm you can do it. i to play piano with my gloves on. <laughs> if, and, you know, and if you can't, I'll just lay across the piano. So, okay. <laughs> Hey, this is, you've, done, you've had such great success with, with these uh, decade tribute albums. What about the 80s really grabbed you that you wanted to do? The melody. I didn't think the melody was still there. I knew the melodies were there in the 50s, in the 60s, and even in the 70s when I, you know, when I had these hit singles. But the 80s, I thought the machines had come in. I thought the, you know, the groove had come in. But I didn't know that there were that many melodies left, like Open Arms. Right, you right. Know, beautiful, beautiful Absolutely. song. And so how do you go about this? Because... You know, you've talked about uh, some of these songs in the 80s, so beautifully written, so beautifully performed. So how do you make it your own? That was a challenge yeah. because they're so well known. Careless Whisper, George Michael and Wim, I mean, they're so well known. It took a while for me to figure out how to put my own myself into it and not touch the uh, the song, you know, it was hard. It was hard. It was a challenge, but I like what we did. It's interesting. We were just saying that this this music really grabs a lot of people. It's still very important to people. I agree, more so than the other decades. Really, everybody knows these songs. So, are there some real standouts for you, I, you know, of some of the songs yeah, that you? Arms and this yeah. the silence in the stream that, that we're going to do for you. That was a big standout for me. Absolutely. All right. Well, Barry Manilow, it is. Uh, it's such a, a thrill to have you here. Um, and in uh, of all of the decades that you've uh, performed on the. 80s is is one that's really grabbing audiences uh, uh, around the country, and what a what a great concept! After all the success you've had, to go back and, and redo some of these songs has it been really gratifying. It has, especially since I, you know I'm an arranger, so I like crawling into these songs and finding different aspects of every one of the songs and without hurting the integrity of it. But yeah, it's been it's been a lot of fun. How do you how did the fingers feel? You think we're going to play the piano here? <laughs> <What is that? laughs> It doesn't I, work. <laughs> I, 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 think we, I think we've got some, some potential here. <laughs> I'm going to try it later on. Anyway, you know, on this islands in the stream that we're going right. to do for you, I did the uh, the uh, uh, I did it with uh, Reba McIntyre on the uh, on the record, and she's fantastic, and she can't be here. So I, I found three or four of the most fantastic singers that I have ever found. They just happen to be the four singers that work with me every night. So we're all four of us are going to do our rendition of. Uh, all right, and and stream. you're going to play a little bit more for us right now. Later, later, a little bit later, later on. Later. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, are you going to play a little bit for us now? You want to yeah, yeah, a little out? something now. What do you think? Take us out. Do a break. Okay. I think people are clamoring for Islands in the Stream, and then we'll go to a break. How about that? Okay. Let's do it. Let's okay. do Islands in the Stream. Whenever you're ready. I, all right? Okay. Whenever you're ready, guys. Stop. 